there's a new YouTube SEO tool in town to help you grow your YouTube channel and get more views on YouTube. Tarja AI brings AI powered SEO to YouTube creators. Tarja AI promises to save you time by handling the whole optimization process for you automatically and announcing Tarja AI's clips feature, which automatically takes your long form content and produces a series of YouTube shorts from it automatically. And it does this fast. Along with generating amazing titles and descriptions, Tarja AI has a dedicated premium thumbnail generator built in. What's more is you can use all of these built-in SEO AI tools and apply it to your entire back catalog of YouTube videos or target just the underperforming ones. There's heaps to unpack with how to grow your YouTube channel with Tarja AI, so let's get straight into it. Here we are on the homepage of the website. You can see here we have the free seven day trial, but it would help me out if you could click the promo link I provided in the description and pin comment below. Okay, once you've signed in, you come over to the main page. So here is the main dashboard and you can see some other videos have plugged into Tarja AI recently to optimize them. The main thing we're gonna be doing in this video is to show how to optimize a YouTube video. But a great thing you can do first is to tell Tarja AI what your YouTube channel is and then you can actually analyze it, which I've done before. But let's go back and optimize a video as this is the bread and butter of Tarja AI. It really does save you a bunch of time by instantly handling the optimization process for you without even thinking. So to do that, just simply click YouTube video and then paste in the link to your YouTube video. It's important to note here that the video can either be new that you've just published and need to just figure out the title, description, tags, etc., or it can be an old video that is underperforming. You just need to make sure that the new video is unlisted and the old video is either unlisted or public. So I'm gonna copy and paste the video here that I've already published, but it's underperforming. So it's a great candidate for a video that I can optimize using Tarja AI to help give it more visibility on YouTube and get more views. And it helps to put in a quick sentence or two about what the video is about in this field here. So I'll put in a quick sentence here, the best three AI based cryptocurrency coins to make money with investing in AI. And then I just simply hit optimize. That will then go ahead and synchronize the video to target AI and analyze the content. Fantastic, that probably only took one minute to do, which saves a lot of time. Let's do a quick overview of what we're now presented with. So we have the transcript of the whole video, a section where it's generated more titles, what the existing thumbnail would look like with these new titles, and a video description based on the transcript of the video and we have some keyword tags generated here and we've got some options to re-optimize all the way down plus generate thumbnails an option to sync to YouTube, and then the next step of generating shorts. But let's come back up to the title section and work with that. So as we can see, we've been presented with five different title options. Now these are generally based on the ideas I've given it in the context field. I could have added in a little bit more here to give different options. And with me knowing the content of the video, I would say that either option number three or five would work best for me. So I would select this one here. That then highlights this option, which shows you the thumbnail with the new title. And if I didn't think any of those titles were suitable, I could go ahead and re-optimize the titles, which I'll do right now. It's given me five additional options plus it has retained those first five as well. So what I'm going to do is choose this one here because that was the best for me. Moving down to the next section which is the description. The video description that Tarja AI has generated is based on the transcript of the video. It's then focused on the major keywords that I've gone after in the video and has sprinkled those within the video description. I think it's done a great job with the description here. We have the paragraph introducing what the video is about. Got some dot points here on what we're going to cover. Some use of emojis. It's very clear and spread out. There's a call to action. We also have some hashtags that it's generated and it's gone ahead and created chapters for us, which is super useful because it breaks up the video into bite-sized pieces. Of course, with the intro as it is, I'd probably need to go through and do a bit of a proofread. For example, the description has used the first option of the generated titles. So we need to change that. I've also referenced different acronyms within the video. Protocol, Fetch AI is correct, but this one is pronounced PAL AI and I'd need to spell that different, but that's very easy to do. And that would again have to be done down here. But overall, there's only a couple of mistakes there. If I wasn't happy with the description, I could go ahead and re-optimize it like I did with the title. Let's do that now. There we go. I sped that up, but it took less than a minute to do. And it's also gone ahead and adopted the title that I chose. We again have an introduction paragraph, what's being covered, a call to action. And again, it's created those chapters for us. As with the title generation, I could do this as many times as I wanted, but you'll notice that it didn't keep a copy of the previous description that it generated. So what I could do is copy and paste each iteration into a Google document and then later select which description I like most. But Tarja AI is program very well to generate a winning description of a YouTube video based on the transcription. It's much better than what ChatGPT would have been able to do with the transcription alone. Moving on to the next couple of steps and we have these tags that have been generated. That's probably a good starting point for some tags. I probably want to put in some of my own as when I created that video, I had some keywords in mind that I wanted to target. Again, I could go ahead and re-optimize tags and that's probably a good 
thing to do because I can copy and paste these tags into a document like I did with the description and choose which tags I want to use later on. And as you can see, we've got a whole new set of tags there, including some ones that have overlapped. So I could collate those and choose which ones I like the most. Now moving on to what is a really exciting feature, we can now generate thumbnails based on the title and description alone. So let's go ahead and do that. It goes ahead and analyzes the existing thumbnails in our YouTube channel so that we stay on theme with what our channel looks like. Okay, that's done. We've got three thumbnails that have been generated here. Now I want you to consider the YouTube thumbnail generation here as inspiration for the building blocks of what we can use to make our thumbnail. For my channel, I like to put my face on the thumbnail so it doesn't have the ability to generate an image of my face with an appropriate facial expression. As I mentioned, there's no character of me there, but later I'll show you how you can quickly edit these to put in different elements and add in some text. So each of these three have quite a good theme. This one here is quite good. It's showing three different coins. It's a very AI and crypto technology based background, but let's say I wanted to create a few more thumbnails to choose from. I could just easily go ahead and generate more thumbnails. Now the generate thumbnails feature is still in beta. It's version one and it's still being tested. This is already generating really nice thumbnails, but it's going to be even better with time. There we are, there's three more thumbnails to choose from. This one here's got a little bit of text, so I'm actually gonna show you how we can easily edit these. First start by just clicking it, and then we'll just download that. And we can open it up in Canva, which is absolutely free to use and edit with. So I'm gonna create a design, we'll select YouTube thumbnail, then I can just drag and drop that file into here. We'll set the images background. So this is what we're working with to start with. And just looking at this, I have three coins that I've mentioned. I can replace those with the actual logos that these coins are. I might like to choose to put myself in there rather than this AI image, and I can also change the text above these, maybe to be bigger and more prominent. Running through this real quick to show you how you can combine automatically generated thumbnails inside Tarja AI with a program like Canva AI Free, we can come to Edit Photo. So you can use Canva Free to do a lot of the editing here, but if you want to do some major editing, you can use Canva Pro. And you can watch this video above to see how to access Canva Pro free for lifetime. So let's go ahead, click over to my Canva Free account. So you can see here with Magic Grab, it has identified this element, so I can go ahead and delete that. And then it actually leaves a nice background behind, which is actually use generative AI. I can then substitute in a picture of myself. So I'll bring this one in. So I'm going to speed through this real quick, but as you can see, I can then grab all the text here, change or delete, and then copy and paste to keep the same style of writing. And then I can drag and drop the logos of the three coins I'm talking about over the top of this. And as you can see, in a matter of just minutes, I've taken an AI generated thumbnail, easily made some changes, and added in one extra title and produced what I consider to be quite a catchy thumbnail, all without me being a graphic designer. Okay, great. Taja AI so far has been absolutely Absolutely amazing in generating titles, a description, keyword tags, and a thumbnail, which I was able to easily edit. So that video would be absolutely ready to go, and I could just go ahead and sync to YouTube to make all those changes save across to my YouTube channel. But I'm gonna move on to the next step, which is generate shorts. It will take the video that I've uploaded, which is a long form content, and then go ahead and generate at least one YouTube short, which I could then publish into my shorts feed by just repackaging the long form content that I've got. So let's go ahead and demonstrate that step. So what this will now do is go through and analyze the whole video and take what it thinks would be bite-sized pieces that could then be used to generate a YouTube short. Fantastic, it has found three short videos, which kind of makes sense because I talk about three distinct topics. One, which was Power AI, two was Near Protocol, and three, this is still being generated, but this would be Fetch AI. So as I already mentioned, there is a spelling mistake with Power AI because it's not a common word. So we'll use the second example here. We have a short catchy title. It even identifies a 235% surge, puts in some hashtags, adds a little bit of a description, and then some more hashtags as well as some tags. So it's all done automatically, super quick, without having to do any editing whatsoever. It's reformatted it into portrait orientation. And let's have a quick look at Me the video. Protocol offers a scalable blockchain solution designed to host the next generation of the app. Okay, that's pretty good. It's taken that whole section and clipped it ready for download. Now, quite often in my testing in Taja AI, what it does is it actually scales the video so that it fills up this top bar and bottom bar, which is quite good. One really awesome thing is it puts the subtitles on the screen, which is very desirable for people consuming YouTube shorts. I'm just gonna mute that for a second. And as you can see, as we read through this video, it highlights each word that is being spoken, which is great for pointing out to the viewer what to read. I'm so impressed in the speed in which it does this. It's able to generate these shorts in a matter of a couple of minutes. And this whole process is so much more powerful than other platforms I've tried to do the same process. Again, this is only version one of the Generate Shorts feature and it's only gonna get better. I know that the Taja AI team iterates things quickly, so the potential of this is huge. And that's done, we've completed optimizing the video. Great, that video is now fully optimized. Now, one other amazing thing I wanted to show you with Taja AI is the ability to do what's called a backlog boost. So I can go into Manage Channel, Analyze My Channel, which when you do it for the first time takes a while, but then the option to do the backlog boost will pop up. And what it's done here is it's 
that's gone through and looked at the entire backlog of my videos and ranked it from low performance to high performance. So that takes into account the number of views it's had per video, as well as how optimized it thinks the title, description, keywords, and thumbnails are. So as a diligent YouTuber as I am, I will now go through and do what's called revive video on all these underperforming videos. And at the moment we have five of those. So that's as simple as going to this first one and clicking revive video. And essentially what that does is I can then go through and follow the same process of adding context. I can even change the tone and language of the video and then click optimize. It will then go through and do the same analysis as it did for the first video in the example. And there we go, that took less than a couple of minutes. Here we go with the transcription, some options for optimized titles, as well as a description, tags, and then the option to generate thumbnails, as well as generate shorts, which will pop up in a moment. So Tarja AI really is an all-in-one AI SEO YouTube optimization tool that should definitely be part of your arsenal for growing your YouTube channel, helping you get more views on YouTube, and helping you to make more money online. Again, it's free to go ahead and use Tarja AI. It comes with a seven day free trial. And again, I'd love it if you could help me out by using the link here in the description and pin comment below. Check out this video now to see how to make sure you're not paying too much tax with YouTube AdSense revenue. Also subscribe to the channel so you can get more AI updates as they happen. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you in the next video.